All right, welcome to another Alana Hans video. Uh, what we're going to do today is build a RJ12 cable um, using Cat5 Ethernet cable and these little RJ12 connectors. So it's a six pin, six conductor device, and these are just uh, bare ones. And we'll we'll make this an actual cord that we can use uh, using something like this. So uh, step one, just lop it off. So now it's nice and even. And then we can use this fancy little guy right here, cut off a little piece of the jacket. So now we have four wire pairs, uh, stripey brown, stripey green, stripey blue, and stripey orange. Now give that a little bit of a haircut. So we don't actually need the stripey brown part for this because we only need six conductors. Um, green or a stripe of green, stripe of orange, blue, stripe of blue, orange and green. We only need those so that's all we're gonna leave. So the first step you want to do is kind of untwist them because they're all twisted pairs and then we'll just kind of lay them out into our fingers with the proper color. So we'll start with stripe green, pull stripe orange over Then solid blue, then, then stripe blue, and then orange. They're all solid core, so you can kind of work them a little bit, and then they'll stay in position kind of pretty well. So let's see, so that's all of them in proper position. But they're all uneven if you look at the tips. So in order to go into here, they all have to be like exactly right. So we're going to give them a little haircut. Boop. Cut that little stuff off. And then just verify that the colors are correct. Um, and also that they're all the right length. So I'm moving, moving it around, actually moving them. So get another haircut. Then you want to slide them into, and this is the bottom of the jack, so there's a little clicker that holds it in place. Here's the bottom of the jack. Just kind of slide them in. And make sure they're all the way in. I'm going to give it a little bit of force, and you can kind of look through the window on the side here. See if I can catch it without glare. So you can look in the window and make sure that the wire, the stripe of green wire is all the way in all the way, and then on this side, the green wire is in all the way. You can kind of verify it by looking at the tip of this and all the wires are pressed nice and flat right up against the edge of the plastic. So you want to kind of hold that in place and you use your cool little tool. Uh, one of them is 8 pin, one of them is 6 pin, so we're using 6 pin. So just put it into the hole, kind of leave some pressure on it and then crimp it off really good. Use a little bit of pressure and then pull it out and then you can kind of test it and it works perfectly. So it's, ni it's nice and on there. You can give it a good amount of force and it'll stay, stay tight. And there's your RJ12 jack. So um, it's ready for insertion into one of these and ready for any one of the other projects.